Wow, that card popped out twice. Wow. So we have hidden emotions. They don't have anywhere to go. This card kind of popped out twice. I was trying to mix it up, but it came out again. So someone does not have anywhere to go. Pisces. We have burdens. They try to block your love life. Celibate. And then desperate. Okay. So this could be, you know, or are you someone that you're attached to, someone that you detach from, or different people that want to come towards you, different people that they're attached to, different people that they have detached from. This is overall past, present, or near future energy, masculine or feminine. So you have to take it where it resonates and leave what does not. But this could have been somebody that had hidden emotions for you. This person could be a Pisces. Um, you could be a Pisces. This person tried to block your love life. And they're dealing with some type of burdens. This person was desperately trying to block your love life. They don't have anywhere to go. And then you could be practicing celibacy. So we have the food car. You moving into a whole nother direction. And you took a leap of faith towards new ventures in life, towards the unknown, you know, away from whatever this energy is. And this person was somebody that was desperate. Knight of Pentacles is here. This was somebody that was only trying to slow you down. They could have been, you know, feeling like everything was slow moving movement around them. And they tried to slow you down. This person tried to block your love life. And it ended up causing them to have burdens. And um, this is someone that had hidden emotions for you. Two of Cups is here. Yeah, they were trying to block your love life. It's like they didn't want you to partner up with anyone else. They were desperate. So they did something and um, they're dealing with some type of burdens. They don't have anywhere to go. Because whatever they tried to do to you that they didn't even have to do. Yeah, five of cups is here in the reverse. So it's like they couldn't get you to be, you know, stressing or missing them, crying over spilled milk or something like that. It's like you're not in regret. This person is somebody that was desperate. Yeah, six of wands is here. It's like you chose victory and success. You chose to hold yourself in high honor and respect yourself. And that's why you went towards a whole nother direction. You could be someone that's having victory and success. And um, a lot of people are respecting you, holding you in a high honor. You're attracting a lot of attention. Yeah, eight of cups is here. And this is after you walked away from this person and you did not plan on looking back. This person was so desperate to the point where they tried to block your love life. And it has caused them to have burdens. They don't have nowhere to go. And this person is literally desperate because they were hiding these emotions. They didn't want other people to know. Yeah, five of ones is here. This person was secretly in competition or secretly trying to one up you. They could have been in competition with you and you didn't even know. All because they didn't want you to move forward. It's like they seen you on the food cart going towards a whole other direction. Then Knight of Pentacles is here. They tried to stop you. They tried to block you. And then Two of Cups. Because they don't want you to partner up with anyone else. <laughs> this is sad. Yeah. This person could also be going through some type of conflict with this um, Five of Wands being here for whatever they did. Yeah, they cause conflict in their own life, trying to block your love life. Yeah, they seen you as someone that's celibate. And it's like this person had hidden emotions for you. 
page of wands in the reverse. So yeah, you're not even in communication with this person. You're not talking to this person or messaging this person or something like that. Yeah, they're just watching. Page of Swords is here. They're just sitting back watching you, observing you, stalking you, spying on you. Trying to figure out how can they message you or something like that. Yeah, this person could have tried to, they could have wanted conflict to be sent your way. They could have wanted people to secretly compete or something like that. Or they could have thought that you would, you know, whatever they tried to do to block your love, like they thought it was going to block your love, like, and you would pay attention to them. And they were, um, like, secretly trying to put you in competition or wanted you to be, I don't know. This person don't know. Yeah, this was hidden. And they've been watching you to try to see if it was working, but it's, it has it does not work. It's like it only has brought drama, chaos, conflict, burdens around them. Yeah, nine of cups is here. It's like if this person wanted you to be jealous or something like that, or wanted you to secret, secretly compete with other people that did not compare to you, it's like you're someone that's celibate, so you weren't pressed about trying to, you know, be in this energy where you wanted to um, pay attention to this person or something like that. They could have been around a lot of people that were the total opposite of you, and they thought they would have these people at the five of wands with you. It did not work. It brought burdens um, to this person. And it's like they tried to block your love life, but they couldn't. Yeah, you're at the nine of cups. Happy. Eight of wands in the reverse. Yeah, this person has slowed down everything around them. It's like they don't have anything coming in quick. They didn't want anyone to come towards you with this eight of wands in the reverse. This person was watching you as wish fulfillment. And it's like you're happy nine of cups. This person didn't know that you move at your own pace. They possibly didn't know they couldn't block your love life. They were blocking their own. Yeah, Ace of Wands is here. It's like you started a new beginning. It's like you took action towards whatever it is you want out of life. And this person could have been in the energy of, you know, Five of Wands or something like that. And they were trying to see if it worked. And this was hidden. This was hidden emotions. This person kept this in the dark. And it's like, you're not crying over spilled milk. You walked away from this person and you're at the Six of Wands having victory and success. You're not even paying attention to these people or this person. Whoever this energy is. Yeah, King of Swords in the reverse. This person did not want the truth to come out. They don't want people to know whatever it is they did. They don't want people to know that they were desperate. They don't even want people to know that's why they were watching you, stalking you, spying on you. They could have told people a whole nother thing. In reality, this person had hidden emotions for you. They were trying to slow you down from getting with somebody else. This is someone that just said, yeah, Knight of Cups is here. They were trying to slow you down from somebody else connecting with you, Knight of Cups. They didn't want people to know that they wanted to connect with you. And they did all of this because they were hiding their emotions. And desperately trying to block you from someone else coming towards you. Now it's like nothing can come in for them. Yeah, Queen of Wands is here. You're someone that's very ambitious. So it's like if they try to have send conflict to you or people to secretly one up you or something like that. It didn't work. You're a leader. You're someone that's very in tune. And this person does not know what to expect out of you with this Queen of Wands being here. They don't know what to expect. That's why they've been sitting back watching you to try to see if it worked. <laughs> I'm so dead. Yeah, Knight of Wands is here. This person was trying to play some type of... And they thought they were going to come in quick and have sex with you. This is sad. It's just sad. And it's like, they, they literally... This is someone that was very immature. And they thought that they were going to come in quick, have sex with you and have you, you know, blocked from whatever's destined for you. Did not work. You walked away from this person and did not look back. Yeah, the lovers is here. And then King of Cups. Yeah. So this is a person that... um. This could have been, the lovers is like a choice. This person wanted you to choose them 
but they did it in a childish way, very immature. You have the Knight of Cups, Knight of Wands, Knight of Pentacles. Yeah. Ten of Pentacles is here. And then Judgment, yeah. It's like you're receiving karma, good karma. You're in the Ten of Pentacles energy. Whoever this person is, they were desperate. And um, whatever they were doing, it just made you walk away and did not look back. Even if this person had hidden emotions, they were childish. And they're going through karma. Yeah. Tower. This person is getting ready to go through a tower moment that they don't even see. So it's like they're inside of the tower and they don't know for whatever they tried to do to you that these are this stuff people don't even have to do. This is sad. Yeah, and it's like whatever they were trying to hide, they made it obvious. They were trying to block your love like they didn't want nobody to come towards you. They caused a whole bunch of conflict and people were secretly, you know, competing with them or something like that. It's like if they were un around people and they didn't want people to know that they had hidden emotions for you, it's like they found out because of the way this person was moving, how desperate this person was, how much this person was watching you. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles is here. Yeah, this person, yeah, it's like you're by yourself and you're someone that's very self-sufficient. You really don't, you know, need anyone at all. You don't even be around people. So it's like, yeah, this person is having a tower moment because you're at this nine of you're single. You're also someone that's celibate. So it's like you're saving yourself for what you know you're worth. Yeah, you're this queen of swords energy. They could have did, I mean, this person possibly did not know, like, it's like once you walked away, they thought it was going to cause a lot of conflict, eight of cups and five of wands, but it did not work. It didn't do nothing but make you not even want to communicate with that person, talk to that person or something like that. Yeah, and they've been watching you secretly, stalking you, spying on you, different stuff like that. This Queen of Swords is someone that's very like, you cut this person off. You spoke the truth. Seven of Cups is here. And then Page of Pentacles. So this person is sitting back confused. Yeah, this person is very confused. This person wanted you to, like, choose them. Like, they knew you had different options or something like that, different people that were attracted to you as you're in this Queen of Wands energy. They did something to try to, like, with spell work. To try to block your love. Like, they tried to place some type of lustful energy onto you. And it did not work. They're sitting back in that energy watching you, obsessed, desperate. Still trying to hide emotions when people know. Yeah, it's like they're being seen in a whole nother light. A lot of people, Page of Pentacles and Seven of Cups, whoever they were trying to confuse, this made these people start researching. Yeah. Six of Cups is here. They started researching different stuff that took place in the past or stuff that this person was doing in the past that did not make sense. This person could have made it seem like they were watching you for someone else. Page of Cups is here, but they were secretly admiring you, Page of Cups. They had hidden emotions. Ten of Swords is here. Somebody feel betrayed. Yeah. Ten of Cups. This could be a whole family. Ten of Cups. A group of people. They feel betrayed. This person did all of this because they were trying to block your love life. They didn't um, 
want people to know how they felt about you. And they didn't do nothing but cause burdens around them. Could be, you know, on their family. This is someone that's very immature. And they did all of this to try to hold on to you. Four of Pentacles is here. Yeah, and it's a lot of people. They feel betrayed. They feel backstabbed by this person. Because this person did this because they were secretly admiring you. This is childish. And they were trying to hide it. And that's the truth, Ace of Swords, clarity. It's like people have gained truth and clarity on... um why this person is going through karma because they're going through some type of judgment some type of burdens and they possibly don't even you know on the verge of not having nowhere to go or something like that yeah it's like they were that desperate to the point where they went to a group of people could have been their family or just a group of people that showed love to them and they lied and the reason why they were watching you it was hidden this person could have tried to hack your, your phone or different stuff like that. And they were hiding the fact that they had hidden emotions from you. They were trying to block your love life or something like that. This person thought they had secretly one-upped you or something. And they've been watching, you know, in secret to try to see if whatever they did worked. It didn't work. You're at the Nine of Cups after walking away Eight of Cups and not looking back. So it's like you're at the Nine of Cups, wish fulfillment. You're happy, content by yourself and it's like a group of people just feel betrayed they feel backstabbed as they were lied to they ended up finding out it's like when you you know when you go to certain people and you lie you got to tell another line another line another line then people start questioning and researching like wait a minute that don't make sense and this is what happened in this case people started researching and observing this person and they realized this person confused them we are not the ones here. They're sitting back nervous. They're feeling guilty about whatever they did because they did it over and over again out of de being desperate. Yeah, this is someone that was secretly admiring you. They didn't know how to come towards you or something like that. And they didn't want you to partner up with someone else. Yeah. They wanted to keep it hidden. High Priestess is here. They did not want people to know. And that's why they're sitting back nervous. They could be sitting back just acting like with this nine of wands and high priestess, they're acting like it's nothing to them. But all of these people feel betrayed and backstabbed. Like this person went that far to, you know, try to block this person from moving forward or something like that. And they did not want you to know. They didn't want other people to know. These are people that held this person in high honor. Yeah, this is sad. Three of Cups is here. And then the Star card is here. Then the Devil. So this is someone that's very toxic. It's like you're in this healing energy and they're in this Devil energy. And they were trying to reconnect with you, but they were trying to hide that. Yeah, Six of Pentacles is here. And then Three of Swords. Yeah, whatever this person did, it just came back on them and it caused them to be depressed. They burdened their self. Especially if this person secretly ganged up a whole bunch of people to try to do different stuff to you. And these are people that didn't even know. It's like they held that person in high honor. They didn't think nothing of it, especially if they were family members. They believed that person. But it's like they had to find out on their own that this person was secretly um, admiring you, had hidden emotions for you. It's like they ended up finding out the truth. This person did all of this to try to hold on to you. Wow. This is sad. Whatever they told these people to try to do whatever they did to watch you or in conflict to you they believe those people i mean those people believe them yeah five of swords is here they're looking at this person now as someone that um sabotaged yourself yeah this is someone that sabotaged yourself they were hating they were jealous and they were envious of you moving on and they tried to slow you down Lie to a whole bunch of people and try to have them gang up on you to betray you. And you don't even know any of this is going on as you had them walked away. <laughs> this 
is sad. Yeah, Queen of Cups is here. They found out this person was in love with you and they were trying to sabotage you because they didn't know how to express the way they felt. And they did not want you to move on to anyone that will match your energy with this Two of Cups being here. Yeah, this is someone that's very toxic and they're sitting back depressed. They just bought... They just brought, brought depression around them. Other people probably were depressed. Four of Wands and King of Wands. Yeah. Yeah, so whatever this person did, it's like somebody found out the truth or the truth got exposed. And it's like, this person could want to come towards you with this King of Wands and Four of Wands. Or somebody wants to come towards you. Yeah, temperance is here. They want to balance a situation out. The hermit card is here. And then the world is here. Yeah, it's like you haven't completed a cycle out. And you've been, and you know, balancing yourself out. You've been meditating, different stuff like that. Going within to investigate. And you've been in hermit mode. You don't even be around people like that. So it's like whatever they told different people, it didn't work. It immediately backfired and made people start looking at them as someone that was envious and jealous. And they didn't believe it in, at first. No, they didn't. The death card is here. This has caused different people to put an end to a situation with that person. This person made themselves look bad. People that normally hold this person in high honor don't even respect this person no more. They cause endings around them. Yeah, Three of Wands is here. And then Two of Swords is here. Yeah, it's like they realized this person made a decision to blind them from the truth so they would never be able to see that they had hidden emotions for you. They were trying to block your love. Like, cause these people would be like, well, why would you even care about who this person, you know, uh, partnered up with or got in a relationship with? <laughs> they knew these people would have questioned them, so they kept it hidden. These are people that found out, though. <laughs> yeah, this is sad. Six of Swords. <laughs> yeah, Six of Swords and Seven of Pentacles. These are people that are selling away from this person, and they're not even looking back. These are people that were sitting back invested in this person. They could have gave this person money and stuff like that. This person could have paid somebody from a distance to do different stuff. To try to block your love life, especially if they were playing with spell work. They paid somebody that didn't even stay in the same area and they lied to that person. That person could have got hit with burdens and karma and they didn't know why. This is sad. <laughs> yeah, because you're an empress. The empress is here. Yeah, you... You're someone that's divine, so it's like, I don't know why I'm so tickled, but this is not okay. This is sad. But they ended up getting exposed. Yeah, emperor and empress. Yeah. And then nine of swords is here. This person is literally stressed out. They see you in this empress energy, and they know that you are you manifesting this emperor energy. Your divine counterpart or someone that, you know, is going to match your energy. And this is stressing them out. Nine of Swords is here. They can't sleep at night. Whatever they did, they're in fear. Ain't no telling how far this person went behind the scenes. But it didn't affect you. It immediately backfired onto them and they did not expect it. Yeah, they're at the Eight of Swords. They're stuck. They feel trapped. It's like they ended up getting trapped in whatever they were trying to do to you. And they feel stuck. Now they're at this nine of swords, a mental prison in their head. Slander, gossip, sleepless nights, and getting exposed for everything that they had did. Yeah, they're at the ten of wands, burdened, pressured, and weighed down. There's a lot of stuff in their face that they did not see, and a lot of stuff on, on their back that they cannot weigh. Yeah, as you're in this will of fortune. Yeah. You're walking in your destiny, so you're only going to get, you know, as, as the wheel is turning in your favor, you're only going to get what's destined for you. And this person was trying to block that desperately because they had hidden emotions for you. Two of Pentacles and then the hangman is here. Yeah, this person is stuck. They're going back and forth in their head, just stuck. 
They could be going back and forth with different people as they haven't got caught. And people are questioning them about whatever they did. And then, you know, gossiping about them as well. That's why they can't sleep at night. They can't get you off of their mind because whatever they told these people to try to, um, you know, send conflict to you, it's eating them alive. And different people are talking about it. So it's like, that's why it's on their mind. 